Da 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 da. Egg TV. That's review. <laughs> My little homage to Matthew Egger and Egger TV there. As you may not or may already know, Loxley Darts is a new brand and Matthew Edgar is the first model that they've released. Uh, these were sent to me by Loxley Darts and obviously Edgar TV is Matthew Edgar's YouTube channel which I've mentioned about before so if you haven't seen it I, uh, I'll put the link up in the description and you can check it out it's well worth having a go viewing it lots of uh, fun things in there and you get to see what happens with a pro player behind the scenes sometimes so very interesting from that aspect so it's nice to see Matthew's getting a set of darts to his name um, I did mention to on the forum that I thought they were a bit pricey at first but then I found out that the only 75 sets in each weight and also the hand painted uh, so in that respect it's probably a fair price I know Matthews often spoke about his £10 set and we all know that you don't need to spend a fortune on darts but you've got always going to pay more for a player's dart no matter what uh, and they are nicely coloured so it's a nice design I think it was Zach Thornton who designed them I think I've seen his uh, little model on Twitter and he's doing some nice designs there so well done to him as well um, these are the 23 gram and the 90 percent but they're also available in 21 grams but like I said there's only 75 sets each weight and I'm not sure if the next batch is going to be like this or whether it's going to be a plain tungsten so if you haven't bought a set already I'd advise you to get a set while you can so let's check them out So as I mentioned this is the 23 gram version and the 90% tungsten and you can also get a 21 gram but there is no soft tip at present and the price is £54.95. Oh, sorry I've already done that bit. <laughs> so the darts come in a plastic clamshell case and you got a lovely picture on the front of Matthew Edgar looking very solemn and mean and moody <laughs> so inside you got a plastic tray plastic tray you got a plastic case I should have said and a point protector with the darts already fitted in and a holographic section there and you've got the Edgar TV logoed flights in standard shape with the blue uh, purple pinky colours and the darts are fitted with some look to be short nylon stems with the, the Loxley name on so that's where you get in the pack so the darts fit with a silver point and it's a straight barrel dart uh, quite a nice looking dart actually them colours a lot nicer than when I first seen the pictures on the internet of them and you've got a tapered nose the front half is made of this kind of slightly wavy pyramid style ring grip um, nicely painted as well I should add got your little black sections and the kind of purpley colours um, probably maybe around about high medium got quite a nice feel to that grip Around the middle, you got a wide band with the rather nice little TV logo. I do like that. On the rear, it's a flat ring grip, so obviously not as grippy, but I think Matthew Edgar grips on the rear and he likes a, a nice grip that he can release easy. But I think he puts his other finger there, so he's got control with that one and nice easy release with them. But it's what you like isn't it some people like grippy darts some people don't um so i'd probably say that's maybe low medium and then on the very end of the barrel you've got your loxley logo and obviously you got the white and blue painted rings there and there's your loxley stems and the edgar tv standard shape flights
That's fitted with a black coated 26mm point. It's got a tapered nose of 4.9mm. The front half is made of this pyramid style thin ring grip that's 19.7 millimeters and then you've got a wide band of 4.6 millimeters on the rear it's a shallow flat ring style grip with quite narrow thin grooves that's 17 millimeters on the end you've got a smooth section of 4.5 millimeters length is 50.7 millimeters width is 6.36 millimeters That's 23 grams exactly, that's good. 23 grams exactly again, even better. And 23 grams exactly, that's really good that. All the exact weight that they stated and all perfectly matched. Full setup is 24.62 grams. There's nothing attached to the balance is just a little front of center and with the supplied setup it moves a little bit towards the rear and this is the balance with medium in between short nylon stems and standard flights. So you've got a mix of levels here basically you've got like a high medium on the front half and a, a low level on the rear so seven for the front and three for the rear obviously the front is a little bit more grippy than the rear but uh, it's not an aggressive ring grip it's maybe just medium to high medium so if you like a bit of grip then that's great and I think having the short stems on is a little bit better because I think the mediums would make it a little bit longer a little bit more fish taily so try it from the middle so it's quite a wide smooth band in the middle no reason why it shouldn't work for any style but obviously it will depend on whether you like more or less grip and whether that's in the position where you grip it I don't think Edgar likes a grippy dart so he grips it on the rear I think but I think he rests his other finger on the front so it gives him a little bit more control what I'm struggling with at the moment because of my dodgy finger <laughs> but <laughs> hello viewers Matthew Edgar here sorry to interrupt your view of my darts review but I just had to get in and tell you that I scored a 170 finish against Gary Anderson in the summer series and I beat him hey hey yippee as you would expect quite nicely balanced from the center there So from the rear, just a little bit more grip from that middle part, but obviously not as much as the front. I'm finding it most difficult thrown from the rear at the moment. It's knocked me mat out of the way. So, even though there's not a lot of grip there, it's not slipping, so it's good. And it should be a nice all rounder this one.
Let's check out the ratings. I'll give it 7 for the looks, grip, 7 for the front and 3 for the rear. Weight match was perfect, so 10. Quality, I only dropped half a point simply because it's a basic style of uh, ring grip, so 9.5. And value, like I said, it's uh, fairly expensive for a straight barrel ring grip dart, but it's only in a limited run and hand painted, so 7. So that's the Loxley Matthew Edgar darts. Um, nice straight barrel dart. It could work for any style. It obviously depends on whether you like uh, more or less grip. For front grippers, I think it's really nice. I think it also helped for me with it having the short stems on. I think if it had the mediums on, it could be a little bit more fish taily. But as it comes, the setup seems to be nicely balanced. So good all round dart. One thing I wanted to say which I forgot to mention at the, the start was you get an extra set of standard shape and an extra set in slim shape. And the other thing was uh, on the barrel you've got the logo in the middle and the brand name at the top and it all matches in line with the logo on the stem. Uh, not everyone would probably notice that but it's a neat touch. Just uh, a little bit of quality control there something i like to see um the other thing was um these darts have got paint on and quite often when they've got paint on it can affect the weight so you may get a little bit of uh difference because some parts of the paint might be thicker than others um but these were all 23 gram which is the exact weight that's on the pack so whether that in the words of Bob Ross, was a happy little accident. I don't know, but it was a welcome one. And I can't, I, I can't really think whether it's happened before all the reviews that I've done, but I have a feeling this may be the first time that they've all matched exactly the weight that's on the pack. So again, that's another good thing. Um, so that's the end of the video. Hope you've enjoyed watching it. If you stick around for the gallery, you can see some close-ups of the darts. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do so. And I'll see you on the next one. Happy darting.